Always alerting, always tracking. This is Next Weather. Everybody's moving to the Sunshine State, and we delivered today with uh, just a completely a bone dry day. We're going to do that again for tomorrow. Hope you're having a nice Wednesday evening. It's a warm one out there with temperatures in the 80s. It still feels like it's in the 90s. And next radar network, unlike the last uh, 24 hours, scanning South Florida here, not finding much. We had a few showers and storms out towards uh, Naples, and even those were far and few between. Very quiet across uh, the waters here, so we're not expecting anything really coming in. We have Saharan air. We talk about that a lot because it's been coming a lot towards us and uh, this is another plume of it here and so for tomorrow I think it's going to shut off our rain chances here. It's a rare dry day. We're surrounded by water here in the middle of our wet season so not to get any rainfall. Unusual certainly. So heat impacts are back and tomorrow I think air quality is going to be moderate. That's already uh, going to be on tap throughout the day so just uh, keep that in mind. Seven for the exhaustion and then heat stroke potential certainly at six if you spend a lot of time outside and you don't Use the caution, right? Drink a lot of water. You know what we tell you? Go back inside, take some extra breaks. This air, by the way, is going to be with us as we head to through Thursday, but I think it lifts enough a little bit on Friday where we're able to squeeze a little moisture here, and that's going to set us up for a few showers and thunderstorms for a Friday afternoon. But limited rain chances are going to continue. We continue to see these plumes uh, of orange coming our way. And yes, if this looks different, uh, this is new technology. You know, we haven't had this uh, for years and years, and that's why you're seeing it all of a sudden now. We're able to, you know, Know, analyze the atmosphere a lot better. So we have all this dust out here, which is not just going to shut off storms over South Florida, but it's shutting off storms in the Atlantic. And that's how we get these tropical systems to develop. We get a grouping of thunderstorms. And once they try to get going, they can't. They ingest all this dry air and they do nothing. So the next five days, we are quiet and uh, we like to see that. August, of course, things are likely going to be uh, very different, but uh, we'll take it for now. Temps in the 80s tomorrow by, well, the time we get into uh, 3 o'clock, will be at 90 degrees. You jump 10, though. That's the way it's going to feel outside. We continue uh, with rain chances low, but 40%. I think that's going to be our best deal on Friday. And then low rain chance. It's going to be a dry weekend. The winds are going to get a little bit gusty there, and then we'll get back into better rain chances, still below normal, for next week.